Hi, this is Brian Perez. I'm sitting here um, at Papa Murphy's new location with Matt and Eric at 565 South College Drive, Suite C, Henderson, Nevada, 89015. Uh, Matt and Eric, they own the Papa Murphy's in here in the, in, the, uh, in, in the Henderson location. And I just want to ask you guys a few questions as far as, I know you've been using the Isaac platform Absolutely. now for how many months? You know, we started at uh, Super Bowl Sunday, the weekend of Super Bowl Sunday. Awesome, and, and just let me ask you, what type of marketing were you doing prior to Isaac? Prior to Isaac, we tried a lot of different things. Well, we have a national print program that we uh, spent last year approximately about $30,000 on, um, sending wow. out pieces to our three mile radius on a monthly basis. And that was a company that we were using called Mercury Works, which also used the Adco shared mail system. We've also tried door hangers, uh, uh, sign in cars, sign waivers, um, just about anything that we could think of uh, to uh, get more customers in, get exposure, let people know about our product. Awesome. So let me ask you this: What? Um, how do you find the Isaac mobile platform working out for you guys? I know you guys just moved um, locations. Um, you guys have been at this location for how many weeks now? Uh, two weeks. And how many how many customers have you been able to capture through the Isaac platform in the oh, short time lot. that you've you been know, using it? We didn't have the money to uh, send out a huge soul mail piece saying, "Hey, we've moved location." We primarily use our Isaac product to get the word out. So prior to us moving to this location, we let our customers know that the best way for them to know when we open would be to join our, our customer, uh, join our opt-in service with Isaac. And we now have around 1,050 people today. 1,050. Wow. Um, so that, that is a, it's not all of our customers. Obviously, some of them in the next coming months will, will notice the signs we left in our old location. But that's a lot of customers that you can reach and let know, hey, we've moved. And I wasn't sure how we'd open. You know, I know that this is a better location, but it's still scary when you close your shop down for three weeks and then you move. Uh, are your customers going to find you? How many weeks is it going to take before you start breaking even? And from week one, we've taken off and have grown considerably. So through through this move, um, you don't have to send out one mailer, not make one same. phone call, no, not one radio ad. You no. just how did you use your platform to notify your current customers that you guys were moving? Um, I sent out a blast the day prior to closing, saying. Everybody, if uh, this is the last day to get your pizza fix, it's going to be a bit, um, and sent that blast out. And then once we did a very soft open the first day on a Tuesday, I wanted to make sure that we were up and running and, and uh, didn't send out a blast to anyone. And then the following two days, I sent, I split the group into two different groups. So about 525, 500 people in each group and let them all come back, say, hey, we're at our new location, come celebrate it with us, half off any pizza. Awesome. Yeah, we crushed it. Now let me ask you this, Matt, what, um, what, just ballpark figure, what's been your ROI, your return on your investment? Uh, probably four or 500% <laughs> a month ROI. Wow. Okay, so I'm spending right now, you know, under, uh, right at $100 a month, because uh, we're still an agent, so uh, yeah, you yeah. got them. Plus package and uh, Pro, and we're at least generating uh, five hundred dollars a month in profit. Yeah, five hundred a month in profit. In profit, not in just uh, gross revenue, but in actual profit. Wow. So you know, on a day like today, I'll probably get five percent redemption. Now, what do you what do you do? What do you use to um, to get individuals to go ahead and opt into your um, well, because we're not spending all the money on the print, we have additional dollars we can spend on savings to the customer. So, for us, I'd rather say... So this is what you're using, right? You guys, yeah. like, check this out. So... That we let the customers know, verbally, when they come in. Uh, so if they, if they opt in today, they get a free cookie dough. Um, if you're in my club, I sent out a blast today, any regular price pizza that you purchase, you'll receive a free large pepperoni. So it allows me to also uh, 
introduce new products to them. So this last weekend, I introduced uh, the calzone line. Anyone that purchased a regular price pizza got a free pepperoni calzone. So there's a lot of different uses of this product, not just uh, make, getting your customers back one or two extra times, which can be huge. Awesome. And, and you know, you've referred us to a whole bunch of different business owners in the in in the community, you know, local business owners. How do you see this platform not only benefiting uh, restaurants like yours, but also other industries? You know, I gotta think if you have customers, this is a great tool to interact with them because it allows you, the owner, to directly interact with your customer base. You don't have to have turnaround time uh, or lag time with any sort of uh, advertising agencies that you might work with. It allows you to directly, on a day-to-day -day basis, identify the needs that your customers may have and reach out to them. Awesome. So if anybody anybody watching this video, if they want to go ahead and opt into your mobile campaign, what do they have to do? Text my papa one word to 90210. Papa, P-A-P-A? P-A-P-A. -P -A. P -A -P -A. Awesome. M-Y-P-A-P-A. -P -A -P -A. Cool. Thank you guys for your time. Hey, you have a good one.